if we wanted to in here we can um just do some seo okay so uh, let me just click preview on this just to see where our headings are ask for a consultant shop around okay so if i come in here and i find ask for a consultant uh, shop around there's one right there all i need to do is just press h2 in front of that and now you'll see when I preview it, whoops, I definitely broke something there with this. So let me see what happened. I think it's something I shouldn't have done. Let me just go back. Oh, what did I break? What did I break? Where's that map? Did I leave the thing at the top of the map? Oh, yeah. I didn't break anything. I just left that at the top. Okay. There you go. You can see shop around. There's an H2 tag now. Um, adding H2 tags to your to your content. You see here. Don't feel obligated. We can add H2 or H3. Um, the, these are important. They're going to show Google that you've um, whoever's wrote these have give a little bit of thought to um, styling, formatting, and also to SEO. Okay. So you definitely get things like your heading tags in there. And for now, this is probably going to be um, good to go. So um, I just need to check one thing real quick. Alex, are you there? Yes. Okay. So on my second tier is going to be social bookmarks linking back to this blog. Do, am I going to need to add a campaign link in here somewhere beyond this to make sure that we get the tier two links or... Is that going to take care of that? Yeah, actually, uh, this button CL, it is uh, for uh, when in first tire it will be have a money site URL link, and the second tire will uh, link to first tire. Okay, so my second tier is only going to be social bookmarks. Yeah. Okay, so how how because the social bookmark is just going to take the first paragraph, right? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. For uh, to create uh, uh, bookmarking, uh, it will use uh, first paragraph. But uh, but uh, as you know, in the description, uh, uh, bookmarking sites do not uh, allow to have link. Yeah. So the software is going to know that when it's taking the money site URL for the social bookmarks, it's automatically just going to pull um, the the blog. URL. It's going to do that within the links manager, yeah? Yeah. I don't need to add anything into this article to make sure that that happens. Okay. So as far as I'm concerned, this is finished now. Would you agree? Uh, yeah, but actually yeah. you may show uh, the case when you use uh, keywords in your article. Okay, cool, cool. So yeah, in, so instead of instead of putting the link down at the bottom here, if you actually yeah. want to, okay, yeah. So some people will want to do that, where they're gonna say, okay, I want to make sure that this here, where it says hairstyles or hairdos, um, it links back to the website um, in the actual body text. Okay, um, I'm probably not going to use that example there because that's within the spin tax, so it wouldn't appear in every article. But let's just pretend we've got something that will appear in every article. I'll just write something at the top. The following article was provided by Hairdressers Charlie. Okay, so... Are you just talking about adding another campaign link in here, or are you talking about spinning this so that it chooses a different one each time? Mm -hmm. Wait, I'm asking you, which would you prefer? Yeah, I'm, uh, use this uh, campaign link for this. Mm -hmm. Okay, but I can yeah. I, we can spin this campaign link, right? Right. Okay, let me ask you this. Uh, no, let me put that back in. It's not possible. Oh. Sorry, guys. Um, let's just say I want to use hair, hairdressers, hairdressing. I shouldn't be spinning like this, or would 